Hello everyone. Before we start our video, let us introduce ourselves. Hi, my name is Kaviraj. Hi, my name is Amni. Hi, my name is Umu Zarifa. Hi, my name is Nur Hasnina. Let's start with our topic discussion. Enjoy! Before that, let me explain about law of contract. The law of contract can be defined by section 2b, an agreement enforceable by law. True, Kaviraj. Easy to say, contracts that are not enforced by law are void. Contracts are enforceable by law while an agreement are not. An agreement refers to understanding or arrangement between two or more parties. A contract can be defined as a specific agreement with term and condition that are enforceable by law. Now, let's move to our chosen topic. Offer Offer is the first element of contract. Section 2A Offer exists when an individual signifies his or her willingness to do or abstain from doing anything. For example, Hi Sarah. Hi Mali. What's up? I have something to tell you. Okay, sound interesting. Today is your lucky day. Lucky day? What do you mean? I heard that you having problem with your laptop, right? Yes, right. And? And I wanted to sell my Samsung laptop for 2000 ringgit. Are you interested? Are you serious? Samsung laptop for RM2000 Yes, I'm serious right now If you say so, I buy it from you Great I'll bring it tomorrow See you tomorrow then Alright Malik Thanks for the offer You're welcome As you can see from example, Malik offered Sarah his laptop for 2000 ringgit. Sarah agreed to buy Malik's laptop for 2000 ringgit. When offer and acceptance exist together, a contract are exist. Offer plus acceptance equal to contract. A contract will not exist without an offer or acceptance. Next, there are four elements of offer that you should know. Offerer must have a serious intention before make an offer. Offer must be certain and definite. To make an offer, offerer must communicate with offeree. 
and effective when it comes to the knowledge of offering. Offer can be made to a particular person or general public. Let's move on to the case. Example case that we choose is about Harvey vs. Fessy in 1893. It started when Mr. Harvey, the mayor and council of Kingston, wanted to buy Mr. Fessy's property in Jamaica. He sent a telegram to Mr. Fessy and he said, Will you sell us bumper hall pen? Telegraph lowest cash price answer paid. Lowest price for bumper hall pen is $900. We agreed to buy bumper hall pen for $900 asked by you. Please send us your title deed in order that we may get early possession. Mr. Fessy then stated that he refused to sell the bumper hall pen. It made Mr. Harvey become angry and he want to sue Mr. Fessy. He stayed. Mr. Fessy replied him about the price was an offer and he accepted. But the private counsel said Mr. Fessy's reply was not an offer. It was an invitation to trade, ITT. The Privy Council also stated that Mr. Harvey's reply was an offer. Because of Mr. Fessy did not accept the offer, so no valid contract are exist between both of them. That's all from us. Thank you.